वेलकम फ्रेंड्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज इंजीनियरिंग कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ गुड बिल्डिंग स्टोन और क्वालिटीज ऑफ गुड बिल्डिंग स्टोन सो लेट इज गेट स्टार्टेड अ बिल्डिंग स्टोन शुड बी हार्ड स्ट्रॉन्ग एंड ड्यूरेबल टू रेजिस्ट वीयर एंड टीयर ड्यू टू एटमोस्फियरिक एक्शन इट शुड फ्री फ्रॉम क्रैक्स कैविटीज फ्लॉज सॉफ्ट मटेरियल्स पैचेस लूज ऑर्गेनिक मैटर्स इट शुड बी क्लोज ग्रेन कॉम्पैक्ट टेक्स्चर एंड ऑफ यूनिफॉर्म कलर द सेलेंट फीचर्स ऑफ गुड स्टोन्स आर एक्सप्लेन इन फॉलोइंग हेड्स फर्स्ट इज appearance it is the important factor when stones are used in the face work of large buildings for the good appearance of the building color and texture of stones are of importance the stones of light shades are always preferred the building stone should have a pleasing and uniform color the stone should be free from cracks decay clay holes etc next point is general structure the rocks having unstratified structure are good for the building stone rocks of a stratified nature will split up along the plane of stratification if not properly placed in it the next point is third point fineness of grain fine grain stones are suitable as the building stone because these having good crushing strength as well as good texture coarse grain stones will easily disintegrate due to weathering action next point number 4 compactness compact stones are suitable as the building stone because these can resist the more pressure next point number 5 weight heavy weighted stones are suitable as building stones because weight of a stone indicates the porosity and density of the stone for structural ability heavy weighted stones are preferred while on the other hand for arch vault dome etc light weighted stones are preferred next point number 6 porosity a good stone should have less porosity because lesser the porosity more the compactness and vice versa more or less almost all the stones are porous porous stones are easily decomposed and disintegrate hence less porous stone will be well suited for the building work next point number 7 durability a stone which is hard and is strong may be durable a good building stone must be durable the durability of a stone depends upon the structural formation chemical composition cementing material and the power of resisting wear and tear next point number 8 is strength a good building stone must have good crushing strength the crushing strength of a stone is varied from 150 to 1000 kg per cm square next number 9 hardness this is an important factor when a stone is subjected to great wear and tear a good building stone must be hard enough generally hard stones are used as road metal and as railway ballast 
hardness is essential for piers abutments and foundation stones a rock not scratched by a knife represents a hardness of 7 and a scratch with fingernail represents a hardness of 2 next number 10 weathering it is the power of stones to resist the wear and tear due to atmospheric actions stones having poor weathering will decompose and disintegrate easily and lastly will damage the structure the stone is more durable if it is capable of resisting atmospheric and other external influences next number 11 point workability a good building stone should be readily workable these should have the qualities of facilitate easy cutting dressing and bringing into the required shape and size next is number 12 point absorption of water a good building stone should not absorb more water more water absorption shows the porosity of the stone a sandstone should not absorb the water more than 10% when immersed in water for 24 hours similarly limestone should not absorb more than 17% of water of their volume a granite should not absorb the water more than 1% So dear friends if you enjoy this video please like it share comment and also subscribe my channel for getting latest upcoming construction materials and building materials related videos also check the playlist of construction materials topic in my channel so dear friends let's meet in another video thank you very much